Mm. Upgrade anytime. At Prairie Mobile, your Sastel authorized dealer. I'm joined by Pat's Ford, Morgan Klimchuk. And Morgan, uh, you get back just in time for the, the season opener from Calgary. I mean, I, I know you didn't get a chance to, to play down there. You're dealing with that abdominal injury. But, uh, you know, how was it in Calgary? Was it at least something that was a different experience for you, or did you get much out of it? No, it was, it was still a pretty good experience, you know, to get down there and even just be around NHL guys on a daily basis and see how hard they work and what their practice routines are like was something that, you know, was pretty, pretty beneficial to me and something that I'm very thankful for, you know. It was great to still go there and you know, kind of get those things done and, and not just sit around here in rehab. So you know, it was still a great experience for me and I learned a lot. How was the rehab in Calgary? They they have another level there. I mean, it's pro and you know they got some pretty good guys doing that. Not to say Greg Mayer doesn't know what he's doing, but you know, is it something different there? No, it's great here for sure. But they, you know, they have some luxuries there that you know are pretty pretty, yeah, I guess, professional yeah, it was the word I would use. You know, obviously they got some tools there that you know, we don't have here. I got an MRI you know, a couple times just to make sure everything was okay and you know, using a laser and things like that. It's just something that really helps you know, speed up the recovery time and something that they're very thankful for. But yeah, like you said, Greg does a very good job here. And so you're back and you're on the ice last night. Is it good to just be playing again? Yeah, you know, it's tough. I, I kind of underestimated how tough it was going to be to just jump back into a game. Um, you know, it's one thing to be in, in practice shape and, you know, be in pretty good shape off ice, but to actually get back into a game and get hit, kind of, you know, get, get your timing back is something that you know, will take a little bit, but it was good to get back out there for sure. What happened last night? I mean, it looked so good in the first period. You guys played so well. You took the early lead, and then and then what happened in the second and third? Yeah, we played a pretty structured game in the first period. You know, we, we stuck to the systems. We kept things simple and, you know, played our game, and we kind of got away from that in the next two periods. You know, the first first period we outshot them, and then we, you know, we got outshot 16-4 to four in the second period. So, you know, that can never happen. You just got to make sure you're sticking to your, your structures and your systems. But you know, we've got a pretty young team. We're still learning. That's something that will come with experience. And that's the big thing is keeping to the game plan for tomorrow night against Swift. Exactly. You know, we know what they're, we're going to see from them. Obviously, they're a good team. they got some pretty good players on the back end and you know, up front as well. So, you know, like I said, we just got to stick to our, our systems and our structures, and we'll do just fine. All right. Thanks, Morgan. Thank you. That's for Morgan Klimchak joining us here today.